What's up fellow Godzilla nerds, my name is Godzilla Glenn, and in today's video we're going to be going over some new LEGO Godzilla builds that will be coming out soon, uh, new LEGO Godzilla projects that I'm going to be starting, or have already started, and just stuff that you could look forward to on the channel in terms of LEGO Godzilla content. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the first thing I want to talk about is our current LEGO Godzilla King of the Monsters build series. So this was a remaster of some of the old LEGO Godzilla builds and some new builds like the Titans. So um, here's our next Titan build. This is going to be uh, the Queen Muto, I think. And so that's her prototype design, I should say. Um, one thing I kind of changed about the design was that she has um, a lot of different legs. But on two of the big legs, I decided to mix them together a little bit, but then have them separate on the bottoms, which I thought was kind of an interesting design. And it was just an easier thing to build since I wasn't able to, you know, get the other arms in there correctly. But so far, I like how the build is going, and this is just an image of what it's looking like right now, but I assume that the final project should look a little bit different. But that's going to be the next Titan build on our LEGO Godzilla series. So if you guys noticed, in the last LEGO Godzilla vs Kong series, we had a total of 8 builds. And this LEGO Godzilla King of the Monster series will be no different. Uh, because we have 4 Titan builds and then 4 uh, Kaiju builds. I guess they still are Titans in this universe. But 4, four main Titans. So that was um, Godzilla, Mothra, King Ghidorah, and then Rodan. And so we already built Mothra and Rodan, and so next we're going to move on to Godzilla. Except, uh, if you have noticed, we've already made a Godzilla build for our LEGO Godzilla vs. Kong. So instead of, like, rebuilding that, just making some slight tweaks, I decided I wanted to do another remastered build of the Meltdown Godzilla. Because I did build a Meltdown Godzilla, but it was based on the old... Um, Godzilla King of the Monsters builds that I had and uh, those have been updated since so I figured that giving this recent LEGO Godzilla build a new recolor of uh, red and yellow and black would look pretty nice. This is just a Photoshop edit of what it might look like but I have not started building this guy yet but hopefully he'll look really cool and I'll make sure to post a showcase video when I'm ready to showcase that build. So I'm pretty sure you guys saw this build in the thumbnail and that's why you clicked on this video, but this is the brand new Godzilla King of the Monsters Lego Ghidorah, and I'm really proud about this build because I was able to incorporate a lot more articulation and more details than his last build, and the problem with Ghidorah is that since he's such a large build, it's really hard for him to stand up with all of the different ball joints and hinges. So I decided to give his head some extra support, which seems to be working so far, but I'm still messing around with things. And then also a problem in the last build was that his wings were way too small, so I made the wings a lot bigger, which was that they're really hard to articulate since they're so heavy. So I decided that they'd be a little bit more stationary than they were on the last build. But so far they're looking really good and they'll still have some hinges on them so that they can be moved but I'm just not sure how articulative they'll be. But so far the build's looking nice. I'm still messing around with it, but I really like how it's looking, and again, I'll showcase it when it's ready. So if you guys are new to the channel, and you kind of just joined for the Godzilla vs Kong builds, and you're now joining for the Godzilla King of the Monsters builds, um, I used to do different LEGO Godzilla series. So I've gone up to series four, which means that I had um, 40, unique Godzilla builds. I mean, some of them are remasters, but who cares about that? So that was how my channel started. And anyway, a lot of people have been asking me like, oh, since you're doing all of these Godzilla vs. Kong series and you're doing these new MonsterVerse series, are you ever going to bring uh, your series back, your series 5? And yes, I actually do plan on doing that this summer. I really want to finish out the Godzilla King of the Monsters builds. And I kind of want to do a few showcase builds here and there just for maybe individual Godzilla films. I've always wanted to do singular point builds because I really like those designs, but I'm not sure if I want to do a whole series on them. So I will either mix those builds into the next LEGO Godzilla series, LEGO Series 5, 
or they're just going to be a few independent videos on ones I want to make like the Mechagodzilla design from that anime or the Titanosaurus design which I thought was pretty cool so a lot of the singular point builds I want to do at some point but I'll have to fit them in somewhere else. And then LEGO Godzilla, Godzilla Series 5 that will have some remastered builds. I know Baragon is one that I built a really long time ago and haven't um, remastered yet. And then there's a few other builds like Titanosaurus and classic OG Mechagodzilla that I want to do that have been built, but again, they were really early on, so I'm not very happy with them. And then I also want to build some different Godzilla variations. I know I have the legendary Godzilla. He's my main Godzilla that I've been using for thumbnails and trailer videos, but I really want to build a Showa Godzilla, a Heisei Godzilla, and a Lego Millennium Godzilla for all of them to tie up the series, you know? So Lego Godzilla Series 5 is happening. It's going to be showcased this summer. 10 new builds, and I'm really excited for it. So hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Those are the builds that are planned to be coming out in these next coming months and this summer. Uh, just because I've been getting a lot of comments on people asking for certain builds or asking me when certain builds are going to come out. So this is the plan. We're going to finish off the Godzilla King of the Monsters series with three more builds. Uh, then hopefully we're going to move on to some more individual builds. And then we're going to move on to series 5. And that should close up some recent LEGO Godzilla events that are coming up. So thank you for showing so much support for the channel and so much support for the series. And just please stay tuned for more LEGO Godzilla videos in the future. Thank you guys. Bye.